Hey, Weekly Walk viewers, happy Wednesday. And it's also crazy, Daniel, that we are in December. That's right. I mean, can you believe it? I think with the year, time moves so quickly that I can't believe that we are, you know, just about 30, you know, about 30 or 28 days away from the end 2021. of 2021. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Which is going to be an awesome exciting. year. <laughs> yeah, I know. So anyway, so I mean, I guess I have to uh, tell tell everyone who, who I'm here with before we just dive right in. That would be awesome. So I am here with Daniel Achompong. Did I pronounce that correctly? That's right. You're right. <laughs> so I got it. All right. And he is a general partner at Visible Hands VC, which I'm super pumped to talk about all the great work that you guys are doing and have you tell everybody about that. But first, I have to tell everyone where we, can you tell people where we are right now? Where are we walking yeah. or sitting? So <laughs> yeah, we are right now at, um, at, at, at Brooklyn Brooklyn, in Brooklyn. So I was born in Ghana and I grew up in Brooklyn. So this is Prospect Park. Um, and I actually took this photo behind us. Um, I, I was sitting, I was kind of walking around Prospect Park and I saw this spot. I, I sat there and I was like, I have to capture it. So this is it. awesome. And I know I'm sitting in a different part of the, I think I'm sitting in a different part of, of, the, uh, of the water, but we're still in Prospect Park together. So that's what's important. So, all right. So I would love to, to just kick off. What, what is Visible Hands VC? Tell us, tell us, you know, who you guys are and what you're doing. That's right. So Visible Hands VC, we are a pre-seed fund and an accelerator as well. Um, and our goal is to really provide a platform that support women and people of color to build great technology companies. Um, and as a pre-seed fund at the core of it, we say that we're talent investors. Right, so we want to identify really incredible talent like the Casey's of the world who want to build a business and say, hey, you know, come work with us. We will provide uh, financial capital. Um, we'll provide social capital, help you find a co-founder. And our third piece is what we call inspirational capital, surrounding you with a team of advisors, mentors, and getting access to customers to really help you build and scale um, your business. That's awesome. So what was the inspiration behind founding this and I mean and y'all are fairly new too. That's right. You know, I was, there there were a couple of things. Um and, and you know my 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 found my partners and I um we all had kind of different inspirational moments that got us there. But you know at the core of it was that there was just seeing so many great talented folks who were not who were to some degree getting um locked out of the system, right? So we called and that was one of the reasons why we called ourselves visible hands that they're, if people are talented and they're ready to build a company, why are they not receiving the opportunities? And specifically, this is, you know, when we look at the categories uh, of women and um, diverse founders, you know, we see, we see these stats, right? Um, they, they don't get enough funding from the VC world. Uh, what, for me, one of the numbers that really struck out to me was that if women and, um, you know, uh, racial minorities make up about 70% of the U.S. population, uh, why are they getting less than 10% of funding? And if you are, say, um, a Black woman, it's less than a percent. Um, so for us, the inspiration was that if there's this incredible pipeline of talent, we want to make sure that we're providing the different sources of capital and um, ecosystem to help them build their companies. That's great. And you guys, are, are, are you officially launched or are you getting ready to launch? How do we find you? How, do, how, are, how are these companies getting money from you? <laughs> That's right. So, you know, we're launching our applications um, for the, the accelerator March 1. Um, so the team is busy, um, you know, putting things in place. Uh, we're also been in the process of raise of fundraising. Uh, we're targeting a million dollar fund. Um, and then we also have the piece of the accelerator, which is uh, we're raising $3 million for it. And a way to, you know, really think about that, those two components is that the accelerator really serves as a, as a, uh, a pre-filter for the fund. Um, so you know, we want to make sure that as you're going through it, you have capital to start um, and then to make it to the next stages of financing, we're able to support you in raising capital. That's awesome. So yes, everyone needs to get on your website. Yes, get on our website. That's right. So www.visiblehand.vc. Um, you can also find us on Twitter, uh, you know, Instagram, LinkedIn, visiblehand.vc, you will find us. All right, perfect. We'll make sure to, to link that in the video too, because we want everyone to go check y'all out. You guys are doing some, some awesome work and certainly we've talked about it before, but definitely a need 
for, you know, a VC like yourself that's, you know, solely focused on people of color and women, especially because it, it really is an underfunded group. So, you know, thank you guys for taking the initiative and doing that. And then, you know, my, my last question for you, now that we're in December, with the holiday season officially here, and as you can imagine, I just love the holiday season. What is yeah. your favorite holiday tradition? And what are you most looking, what are you most looking forward to? Yeah, so you know, I um, I have uh, seven nephews and nieces, okay. and I love spending time with them. And usually every holiday, uh, we we normally get together on Christmas Eve or on Christmas Day, and we you know we 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 do kind of surprise gifting. Um, this year we have to be a little bit more innovative with um, yeah. with, with the virtual environment, but yeah. just you know seeing kids open presents mm -hmm. right and the eyes yeah. lighting up you know, that gets me so excited. Um, or when you give them a present that they don't like, they're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's, so I love that's, it. that's awesome. So you need to get on. Have you, have you done your gift purchasing yet? Yeah, I, I am so late, although okay. I think, but so far my nephews and nieces are starting to, to get used to the, like my gifting. It tends to be something related to like academics, right? So it's like, I get them books. Um, or, you know, something to write with. So they always know what to expect. Okay. So I'm a little bit creative this year. Okay. All right. Well, we're going to hold you to that. We'll check back in after the holidays to see yeah. if you, we've got creative with you, with your gift giving. If anyone has any ideas for Daniel, definitely let us know. So yeah, awesome, you know. Daniel. It was so great chatting with you. Keep us posted on Visible Hands and Weekly Walk viewers. We'll see y'all soon. Bye guys. Thank you so much.